the zany Adrian Mathewitz. Hello. I really love this. Uh, so many voices with one poem each thing, both because I've been able to hear so many voices unfamiliar to me and because I only ever like one poem I've written at a time. Yeah. So this is my one poem for now. Ultrasound. One. Growing inside of us, always, our infinite potential faces. A miracle of life. A miracle of personification in gray. You shift on the couch and develop, briefly, an alien's profile below your right lung. It yawns and reveals a set of soft, glowing teeth that implodes on itself, gets sucked into the Bermuda Triangle that has appeared right off your sternum. And we all toast to that. Two. Is that a baby? I ask the technician as I sprawl wide in her dimly lit room, riveted to a television broadcasting gray milk of my insides, swishing and bulging against that wonderfully phallic x-ray wand. Is that a baby? The goo they use on these things is warm and fills me with good feeling. And it's comforting, too, to know you're not exactly empty inside, just overcast. That one's a donkey. This is the Batmobile. Is that the Virgin Mary? Is this my long-lost twin who would have understood me completely? Is that a Seattle tea shop with a smiling boy? Does that kind of look like the complete Oxford English Dictionary? Is that the little rabbit I always envisioned saving in a warm shoebox of straw? Is that a, is that a baby? No, she says, that's your intestine. <laughs> Which is good news because I've been hoping for an intestine. <laughs> While a baby, a real face with its real nose, real brains inside of me, is a little too parasitic for my liking connecting to me with its belly button tube, made wholly out of stolen parts, shitting into my veins, causing a fucking ruckus. <laughs> Three. I learned something today. What is that? The uterus is only two inches wide. Two inches wide? Two inches wide. See, there is too much me inside me to make room for baby. There are too many faces already, too many monsters lurking in between rib cages, too many giant tongues, too many sagging mouths, too many soft teeth. Baby, they'd swallow you whole.